Okay, so it looks like um, we're having a little more trouble taking the name and drawing the compound. The way I would do this, well first we know it's a heptane, so there's seven carbons in it, and it's a bicyclic. So already we know that there's the two bridge head carbons. That's where I would start, okay? So just maybe two carbons like that, okay? What are we saying? It's bicyclo, but four, one, zero. So there's really only two fused rings here. One of them, one of the uh, rings isn't present, right? So um, what, what can we say? So let's go zero. So there's gonna be just a line between the two bridge heads. One, right, so there's one carbon between the two bridge heads, like that. Okay, and then four. And then four, so um, between the two bridge heads, one, two, three, four. And then we have that, okay? So that's the compound right there. So this is bicyclo 410 heptane. Okay, so let's prove that to ourselves. Just go backwards and figure it out, right? So, bicyclo, yes, there's the rings uh, that have the two bridge head carbons. Seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So it's a heptane, right? And then zero carbons in between those two, one carbon in between those two going that way, and then one, two, three, four carbons going that way. Okay. Any questions on that one? Did anybody get it right? Without? Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. Okay. Oh, it sounds like somebody's the big winner out there. <laughs> okay. Any other questions? So you're talking about did you draw the that one like that or? No, like if you were to draw any of out of the four dots, if you were to draw it like a different way. So you're saying like uh, I don't know, try to draw it as a chair or something like that. Yeah, or something. You could do that, right? Okay. So it doesn't matter which way you draw, just the form of the That's the same compound, right? Yeah. Okay. That's an ugly drawing, but. Mine's <laughs> upside down. Okay, yeah, well, that's, you're doing it in a chair structure. Okay, any other questions? Yeah? 